Right, so I'm here with one of our favorite clients of all time, Ms. B. Harris. She's come down to visit us on campus here, and um, B has been a client of ours for mm -hmm, about five years. Over five years now. Mm -hmm. And uh, B, I wanted to ask you, what has JWV meant to you? This has been a real learning experience for me. Uh, this was something that I would never have thought to do because my husband and I owned real estate years back and it was a disaster. And uh, I met you at a seminar because they had donuts and coffee <laughs> and I had to stand and eat it and I couldn't. And you had a little meeting going on and I snuck in and sat at the table. I remember. Uh -huh. I remember. And, uh, and I listened to you, all of the fellows in the red shirts, young, so full of life and enthusiasm, and I really liked what I heard. And uh, then we came down here, and you treated us royally. You really did, Greg. And uh, uh, I knew for a fact we weren't going to buy, and I told you that over. I remember and that. over and over. I remember. Until we bought three houses the first day. What happened? <laughs> You're so cute. <laughs> <laughs> I do it all the time. Oh, Jesus. But, uh, and, and you've never let us down. You never have. JWB has done for us what I don't know of anybody else. We've made other investments, and some of them have not been so good. But you have never not delivered what you said you would deliver. You have never let us hang. You have been there when the phone rings someone's there you talk to us you treat us like family and uh and something you do that i can't believe anybody else would have done we have little accounts for our grandchildren and outside of putting them into a savings account at zero point nothing percent you allowed us to join our money with their money and invest and as a result of it, the kids are going to have some money someday when they graduate. I mean, you let us start with $500 per kid and let us, and, and, and it has grown unbelievably. And uh, we do the private funding with you. And you, you used to say, how did you used to say it? Over promise. No, you would say what? Under, under promise and over, over deliver. One of our core values, right? You nailed it with that one. You really did. You nailed it. Uh, we still have the same three properties. You keep them rented, uh, and when they're not, you tell me why. You let us know. There's just no, um, there's no mystery when I call or when you call me. And that's the other thing. Lauren calls. She keeps me informed even when I don't want to talk to her. She calls. <laughs> <laughs> She's such a good kid. But uh, seriously, I. I I couldn't be more pleased. I wish I could tell more people. I really do because you do over deliver on everything that you promise to do. And then there's that side of you that's so community focused and I've always admired that. The, the work that you do in the field, you do work for people who need help. You do Christmas things for people that you don't even know. And, and that touches me because that means it's not just about the company it's about giving back to your community and we don't live anywhere near here but i'm i'm, I'm glad to and be then, a part of this and on thanksgiving week you guys decided to come down and see us which means the world to us you know we were not in in the trip plans originally yeah, you yeah, guys yeah. came out of your way um, we did <clears throat> it's um it's been an amazing relationship that we have we're so glad that we get to serve you guys thank you so much thank you.